Hey guys, it's Iwana Turtle, and we are opening another box of Ravnica Allegiance. And right now, it's it's as a filming of this, it's pretty late. I got work tomorrow. I have a long day tomorrow, even. But we're definitely continuing with the openings. Uh, just having a really good time opening this new set. It's it's always fun just to, especially when you you know a lot of the cards, but like not all of them. Just very exciting. So we are, once again, we're going to break this into two parts, uh, especially when the packs are all new to me. I tend to go a little on the sluggish side, so I figure it makes sense to break it up into two videos. Our first box started kind of slow, but had a very strong finish. Very happy with the results. If you haven't seen that video, I definitely recommend you go check it out. So let's jump into box number two. And for pack number one, we got a Biogenic Upgrade, Junk Troller, Essence Capture. And then for our first pack, we have a Judith the Scourge Diva. We actually pulled one of those earlier. So, very strong start. All right, we got Balrock, Knight of Last Breath, Tower Defense, and then Mass Manipulation. So expensive, but very cool card. I wonder, wonder if there's a way to where you can just ramp up and then basically take control of everything. So you would need eight just to take two guys. That's it's a little high. All right, Frilled Mystic, Spire Mangler, Carnival and Carnage. Ooh, nice, Godless Shrine. I feel like these are very, so far every single rare we've gotten from our last box. Let's see if that pattern continues. Bear in mind, this is only my second box, so everything is uh, is still pretty fresh. I feel like I can definitely... Uh, Cinder Vines, yep, definitely got one of those as well. That was like the, kind of like a burn enchantment. Interesting. I think if, if there's any like duplicate mythics and things are starting to be a little suspicious although to be honest I would not mind that at all okay this is a new one precognitive perception so for five mana which includes two blues draw three cards and then addendum if you cast this card during your main phase instead scry three then draw three cards yeah. so it is an instant but then the instant is the part that makes it less powerful. Sounds too expensive. I see a foil back there. All right, we have a Vindicative Vampire, Wall of Lost Thoughts, Sentinel's Mark, Ugh. Repudiate, and then Replicate. Night of Sorrows. Thought the foil might redeem it. It did not. Okay, we got a Gate Colossus. Clear the stage and Fire Blade Artist. Oh, another Bedeck and Bedazzle. I think this one we got last time as well. So I think we have one unique rare so far. To be honest, I don't know how many rares there are in the set, but I feel like it's a little early to be hitting a lot of dupes. Or not dupes in the same box at least. Dovin's Acuity, Scrambling Claws. First time I've seen this one. All right, just for one artifact, target player. When tap for target player, exiles card from their graveyard. Uh, and then sacrifice, exile card from a graveyard, draw a card. 
another absorb. Happy with that one with a foil root snare. Another card that we've seen before in the, from the first box. All right, rally to battle. Drill bit. Collision and Colossus. And then Warrant and Wardened. All right, this is another first time. Ooh, okay, foil common. All right, Windstorm Drake, Shark to Crab. It's a bad sci-fi movie character. Syndicate Guild Mage, and then Stomping Ground. Very nice. Second Duel Land, or Shock Land. All right, another Shaman. Eyes Everywhere, Smelt Ward Ingus, and then Tithe Taker. All right. This is a card that I'm hoping makes a makes a surprise break. Right now, it's not worth that much, uh, but I did obtain a couple extra copies just in case. I feel like it has potential. So during your turn, spell your opponent's creature cost costs one more, but it's only during your turn uh, to cast abilities and as well as abilities as well, unless they're mana abilities. After life one, so you get a white one one. Um, Spirit after it dies. Put this one actually in this pile. So it's kind of like significantly a weak version of um, what's that? Two one first striker. His name escapes me. Sneak. Zerta goblin combine guild mage. Ooh, all right, our first mythic. Dovin, Grand Arbiter. So it's one of the uh, Planeswalkers that only costs three. Very nice. Let's see. This one belongs here. Let me put this over here. All right. First Planeswalker, and it's a good one. Or first Mythic, rather. Or I guess both. All right, Sphinx of New Pra, Regenesis, Spire, Spirit of the Spires, Revival and Revenge. Ew. Man, just this opening new set is just really exciting. So like they have that mythic edition box that costs like a ridiculous $250 and and I feel like it's it's such a terrible buy deputy deputy detention nice pull um, however just like this how much I'm enjoying opening a, a brand new set um, I don't think I'm gonna do it because it, it that's just way too much um, especially if like the primary thing you're just getting like these uh, those the planeswalkers is definitely not worth it but i will admit that is tempting so for our rare we have a immolation shaman so for two whenever opponent activates ability artifact creature or land that isn't a man ability it deals one damage to that player and then for five plus three plus three and gains menace till end of turn Ooh, okay foil cindervines that is pretty cool put this over here so we did get a rare foil Organize our piles real quick So everything's in the frame Okay, we only have three packs left unfortunately and For the start of the fat the box the first half. I would say it's it's Not great, but it's good. It's, I feel like it's a very solid start got a couple fetch lands a pretty good planeswalker and then a Plaza of Harmony. That is not helping my case. Two packs left. Sunder Shaman. Vindictive Vampire. Skyguard. Then the Lumbering Battlement with a Foil Uncommon in Consecrate and Consume. 
All right, last pack. <laughs> I've been going to the rock gym a lot this week, two days in a row doing bouldering for like maybe an hour and a half. So sometimes it's hard to open the packs. All right, so final pack. Consecrate Consume. Angelic Exaltation, first one we've seen that. Spire Mangler. Then Mirror March. Okay, so I'm gonna maintain it's a solid star. Not or solid to weak weak to star. average. We'll go with like average. Alright, so we do have a deputy of detention. Card that I happen to be a fan of. Tight taker, same thing. So for the Shocklands, we got a Stomping Ground and a Godless Shrine. Very nice. A Judith, a Scourge Diva. Another good hit. A Foil Cinder Vines. And then for our Mythic, we have a Dovin Grand Arbiter. Okay, so um, as always, thanks for watching everybody. Uh, if you did enjoy the opening or you're really happy to see Ravnica Alliance being opened on the channel, please drop a like, I really appreciate that. Um, if you're not already, I recommend subscribing to the channel, especially if you wanna see more of this, we're gonna definitely be pumping out these videos for uh, at least a little bit. So with that in mind, uh, thanks again for watching guys and I'll see you guys next time, later.